have worked with big marketing budgets in your career right now from moving from big marketing bud- budgets to startup where uh, you know budget every budget needs a check you know you need to be very focused about your budget so what is your experience with the narrowing budgets narrowing marketing budgets and how challenging it is to effectively not only to reach to the target audience but also to make them your brand advocates yeah see it's it's something really i've kind of faced that uh, what my life throughout the three decades uh, i would tend to believe and i have almost al- always said and that, that i'm a human being first before being a marketer or before mm-hmm. being a professional uh the point i'm trying to make is that yeah and yes uh, the the budgets at hero moto corp or budgets at hyundai since we're launching hyundai were uh were, if i were to say unlimited in that sense uh but you know like i said in the beginning uh it's it's about ownership uh and if the budgets are big doesn't mean that you can just splurge or you can you know forget about smaller details i've always worship my work and <laughs> and i believe i need to own those budgets even if they are not mine um you, you know uh, so you know it's all about being absolutely thoughtful careful uh, and detail oriented no matter what size of the budget is so even in hero moto corp and hyundai and elsewhere I've always tried to save uh, every little rupee. I've always tried to fight, and I'm kind of infamous for that with channels and with newspapers and with media agencies for mm-hmm. for fighting for everything uh, mm-hmm. and and quarrelling with them on a daily basis. <laughs> as far as my as far as my work is concerned, so I fight for every rupee, and and hopefully that will come to good use when I kind of start my own journey or when I have to kind of work within very very limited means. Uh, and and the other thing which is important that we need to understand is that when the budgets are big even that small portion that you're able to save is a lots of money mm-hmm. and and you can put it to a different use which will help the business and which will also help you shine as well at the same time so i have interestingly okay. found that if i save money out of mm-hmm. a 1000 crore that i have mm-hmm. uh, even that even that 1% is 10 crores and i can put it somewhere uh, which will my boss will wonder oh where where did this come from and he'll be happy about it it will be good That's for true. the business and will good for myself so i think uh, you know you you have to be careful about every rupee whether the budget is big or small and, uh, and and that's the philosophy that's kind of i've lived with all my life and hopefully that will help me as i go go forward in my in my new chapter in life definitely that is going to help uh, you yeah. because uh, see here uh, how i mean you have just uh, you know uh, put the light on the ownership part you know a main yeah. part is on the ownership how uh, closely you take that budget on your own so the responsibility yeah. the sense of responsibility which you had and which one should have towards any budget that is going to define the results in multi folds because now you are responsible for the result